Hi everybody, I'm Jerry Kazaya and I want to welcome you to the Auto Shop here in beautiful Plano, Texas. Our telephone number is 972-578-0588 and today we're working on a G20 van. And what does that mean? That's a three-quarter ton full-size converted van that we have here in the shop and the customer came in they had a grinding in the rear end of their vehicle and the brakes didn't work so well so we brought it into the shop and we opened it up we pulled the drums off and take a look here you can see all the fluid in this area this is not supposed to be wet this is all grease and and uh, gear lube oil from the differential and you think how in the world does that get here well it turns out that watch this see the movement in this axle that's not supposed to do that. The bearing has been destroyed, which and it causes the seal to leak, and the seal allows the oil to get in here, and it saturates the brakes. Oil and brakes do not work well at all. So now what we're going to do is we got Kenny over here, one of our master techs. He's going to open. We've got the differential open. Here's an opportunity you can see what it looks like inside. He's going to remove the set pin, and then we're going to pop out the axle. We've got most of this all ready for you so that you can just see what we're doing. This comes out, and then we're going to take the pins, push that in a little bit. Let's see if that did it. Have to hit it. And now we're going to see if this thing will slide out without any much more problem. There you go. Uh, see, it's caught in the the bearings. Got it caught. Okay, so now that we had to, we actually had to stop the video to get this axle out. It was so bad. But look at the groove here in this axle. Man, that's terrible. You got an eighth of an inch groove. This thing's been making noise for a really long time, and it may have actually destroyed the housing. Uh, so we may end up having to replace the entire differential assembly on this van. Uh, you know, this is another classic example of when your vehicle starts making noise, get it into the shop as quickly as you can. We can save you lots of time and lots of money, and you don't always have to replace everything on one of these vehicles when it starts making noise unless you let it go too long. So if you have questions or comments, please put a like on the Facebook page down there at the bottom. We like that. And uh, if you have questions, give us a call, 972 Five seven eight zero five eight eight, and I'm Jerry Kazaya at the Auto Shop in Plano, Texas. Thanks, everybody. See you next time.